In the video posted by the Team Mom Instagram account, Ryan can be seen sitting on the couch with a large distance between him and Mashi Bookout, with whom he shares his 14-year-old son, Bentley. The moderator begins by asking Ryan, Tell me, what is your vision for a healthy co-parenting relationship with Machi that would give Bentley the best experience of his two parents? Ryan replied, I'd just like to be able to, I guess for Machi to be okay with just being able to see him really. I mean, I haven't got to spend any time with him, just me, in a long time. After this moment, Ryan's eyes start to fill with tears and he's sniffling. The moderator moves to his side of the couch to comfort him and bring him tissues. Ryan continued, H asterisk asterisk all, I just miss him. He's then asked, what part of the relationship is your heart saying you miss? To which he replied, just race in him. The moderator then asked Ryan what he would have done differently. His response was, there's a lot of times I wasn't there, just to see him play ball or just put myself first. At this point, Machi is also shown crying on the other side of the couch. Finally, the moderator asks the million-dollar question, do you think you can commit to showing up more? Ryan just nodded and said, yeah. Ryan's mother, Jen, was also shown on the sidelines crying as she heard her son discuss how much he's missed out on. After watching the clip, Fans of the MTV franchise have conflicting feelings about Ryan and whether or not he deserves sympathy. One wrote, Don't feel bad for him. The only victims are those kids. As a child of a parent who is an addict, those tears don't mean diddly to me. Someone said, I'm crying but also Ryan needs to fix Ryan before he can be any type of father for Bentley. A third chimed in, I'm proud of Ryan for being aware of the pain caused to his son. As an addict in recovery, the DE, DURDC of ER. This is a huge step for Ryan and I'm proud of him. Another commented, Are we supposed to feel bad for him? Last week, the U.S. Sun exclusively obtained court documents regarding a petition for an order of protection against Ryan from his wife, Mackenzie Edwards. Ryan allegedly threatened his wife, Mackenzie, with a pocket knife and held her against a wall by her neck in front of their children, she claimed. This came before Ryan was arrested for harassment, possession of drug paraphernalia, possession of a controlled substance, and an order of protection violation on February 10. She requested temporary custody of their children, Jagger, 4, and Stella, 3, though she did not ask they be protected from their father. Ryan told the U.S. son of Mackenzie's claims, I don't speak for her. I never wanted to hurt her, just tried telling her. I would have loved to work it because I still at the time wanted to.